Moonshine Life Recipes Group Bacterial Fermentation Although bacterial fermentation is rarely mentioned among hobby distillers, I think it is worth a brief discussion. As you gain some experience with fermentation and distilling, you may want to experiment with it yourself. Esters are compounds that are formed when an alcohol molecule bonds chemically with an acid molecule. This bonding process happens during all stages of liquor production. Different yeast strains produce different ester profiles during fermentation just as in beer production. And free acids in solution eventually form additional esters during the aging process of spirits such as whiskey and brandy. Free acids are found in oak barrels, as well as in the various yeasts. And bacteria naturally present in the wash. Some lactobacillus bacteria, for example, produce lactic acid, while other strains produce other kinds of volatile acids when they consume sugar during fermentation. Those of you who make cheese will be familiar with this acidification process. When these acids bond with alcohol, they esterify into a wide variety of flavors such as fruity and floral notes. For example, lactic acid esterifies with ethanol into ethyl lactate, which tastes like buttercream. Lactobacillus can even consume other acids, changing them into different ones, resulting in unique flavors. Lactobacillus is most active at the beginning and end of fermentation. It is more or less dormant during the anaerobic phase, when yeast is most active. This bacteria, especially L. thermophilus, heat-loving, which is already present in the air and on the grain you use, survives the heat of fermentation during sugar conversion and continues to multiply. Its reproduction slows down as the pH of the wash drops during fermentation, but it becomes more active as the yeast cells start to die off. At this point, the lactobacillus consumes nutrients in the yeast, sediment and any residual sugar it finds. As it eats, it begins to produce the acids that will later form esters. There are many different strains of lactobacillus. For the hobby, distiller, it is convenient to find them in small freeze-dried packets. Where cheese and yogurt making supplies are sold, homebrew shops often also carry a refrigerated liquid form. You can add the bacteria to your wash when you pitch the yeast, or try adding it several hours before adding the yeast. They will produce different acids and therefore different esters depending on which phase of fermentation they are most active. Enjoy Moonshine Life Recipes Group. Cheers.